Hello, my name is Cynic, and you are watching another episode of Empress Thelonious's um, attempt at a Bannerlord 2 playthrough. So far, we are been at war with several kingdoms, empires, if we're being uh, semantically correct. Um, and currently, we are at war with two. So we are at war with the uh, the Coloradian Empire, which we have the upper hand in. And we're also now at war with the Kyrgyz. However, I uh, I need to, I'm not planning on I don't know kind of dragging out the Kyrgyz war primarily because I don't want the gains we've made against the Colorado Empire to kind of be reversed. Gains in a sense is not land, but only um, military victories. So I need to wait nine more days before I can propose peace with the Kyrgyz as opposed to making peace early and paying a relatively large amount of tribute per day. So the goal for this episode is to get through the next nine days without the Kogi taking over any of my land and then going on the offensive, if possible, against the Kalradian Empire, at least getting Matakia Castle and hopefully Onira, because then I can join my two kind of um, my exclave of Cyronia with my main kingdom, uh, which is uh, the capital of Kuvai. So that is the, the large overall goal. And um, yeah, let's jump into it. Okay, so perhaps I won't be able to wait the full <laughs> the full time with uh, this person, because now, now more people are coming to join up, even though I've defeated these motherfuckers so many times. Okay, so the dis disregard what I just said, uh, we can't actually wait the full nine days against the Kyrgyz. We're just gonna have to pay them off for now, but we will... We will get our own back, I think. We will get our own back. Okay, <laughs> we managed to sneak in before them. So uh, once again, uh, we are find ourselves defending Cortesia Castle. And let's see how it goes. Oh, they're trying to get tribute shares, huh? Maybe I can knock a bit of their army off. Okay. The attack is abandoning the siege. Why? Why did you abandon the siege? I need traveling to Onira. Um, well, it might have been better if I could have defeated them here, to be honest. Maybe I can get them to lure. Traveling to Danistica. I don't trust them. I don't trust them, and I don't like them. Yeah, fuck that. At the very least, I'm getting this castle. I'm not coming away from this huge war with nothing. In fact, I'll take them all out. I'll take them out completely. So, Metakia, you're mine. You're mine now, Metakia. You will be. Alright, let's join up, besiege the castle, give us a siege ram, no, a battering ram, a siege ram, I don't know where that came from. What's this, what's this, a battering ram, there we go. At the very least, give me my battering ram. I keep an eye out for that big ass army that was around there. So auto deploy. What a, what a shitty, shitty, shitty formation. Like a long line of them. What are they even doing? I don't know. I don't know. But uh, if, if I control them manually, nothing will happen. So, automatic control it is. Or automatic, um, no, instructions. Automatic control doesn't seem... Okay. Like it exists, you either control it or it's automatic. Okay, oh look at that. Fucking hell. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Can't really, can I? I see you wait for my battering ram to, uh, to arrive. I think this might be the first battering ram we have built ourselves. So uh, th this is uh, from advice in the comment section. 
to, to tell me to um, build siege equipment. Uh, oh, no one died from that. That is, um, that's lucky. It's very lucky. Put some archers up here. Good stuff, good stuff. That is a very steep hole to push up a uh, battery ram. And this guy is just pretending to push it. He's actually just jogging, <laughs> jogging in one spot. Okay, he wasn't actually trying to push it. And these guys just... Are they, are they even moving forward? Like, min minutely. <laughs> uh, these guys are running away, I guess. Because uh, the slingers have <laughs> run out of... Uh, stones oh someone died there we go they're almost at the top of the hill and now the fun part begins hold f to select arrows oh zevia oh yes zevia she is that has that very good equipment with her sister Metuda or something like that. I can't remember. Alright, there we go. Smash! Boom. Excellent. These guys are going to go through the main gate. These guys are going to go through or up the ladders. And then... Yeah, there we go. The assault has officially begun in earnest. Amazing. Maybe I can uh, check a little spear here. No, that wasn't me. Whoa. 13 damage. Back off. Oh wow, what a dodge. What was that? Yeah, 6 damage. Oh well, piss off. Let's go. Apparently, sturgeons will um, chop at the gate and get wood. How cool is that? Boom. Not really anything, actually. Oh, okay, I did something. That's cool. Just happened to be in the, the spot where I hit. They got a measly defense force here. Measly. Ooh. Let's go. The Emperor's broken through. Yeah, they only got militia spearmen and uh, levies, so not much, not so much going on there. Slingers. Yeah, this is going to be over pretty fast, I think. So only do they have an inferior number of troops, they also have inferior quality of troops. Okay. It might be okay if they had uh, better troops, but um, as I said in previous episodes, my, my troops are battle hardened. They are hard motherfuckers, and these guys are just little city guards, really. And they don't stand a chance. Look at that. It's basically, as soon as we took the walls and the gate, it was over. I mean, that is. Probably uh, what happens in the siege, but still. They didn't even put up a fight. It's just a lot of blue. If, uh... If blood were blue... Oh, distinct... Oh, yes, I have a new mod. Distinguished soldiers. So instead of recruiting wanderers, I get to recruit um, people who've done particularly well for themselves. You can choose up to two or none to fight as your side, at your side as a companion. Right, I'll choose Empire Legionary. Select Skill Focus. Um, damn, that's pretty cool. So he was obviously <laughs> chatted everyone up. Um, oh, so you can bought and sold items from towns you visited. So this would be good for a a um like a caravan leader. That's very cool. That's very cool. But uh, he definitely was a trained for combat. Um, Amathenius the Shark gained 100 skill points in athletics and is now 263. 
Damn, man. That's an Olympic level athletic skills. Uh, right. So, manage. Go to the. Uh, yeah. Go to the dungeon. Manage prisoners. To get the prisoners. Eutropius. Was he in the castle the whole time? Isn't that funny? Shit. It's going to be tough. I mean, it's not going to be an, a very easy battle. <laughs> Saved again. <laughs> okay, wait here for some time. Ugh, where are they coming from? Besieging Metakia. Yeah, I understand that they would. Um, I think I can take him though. I mean, I think so. Unless they just keep adding more people to this army, then um, maybe I can't. This guy seems like he's going to... Someone has escaped. No, don't join. Don't join. No. <laughs> Piss off. Um, okay, hang on. Let me upgrade. Do I have a carrot to upgrade? Uh, there we go. I wonder why I'm getting um skill points in polearm. Um, I really don't know why. Is it that uh, that big mace that I have? Is it a polearm and a two-handed? I'm not sure. Uh, I'll go for braced. Throwing, yes, it's always, it's always a good one. We melee usage of thrown weapons deals plus 10 more damage. Uh, I'm not a captain. 40% more damage with throwing weapons against horses. Yeah, that is my... My <laughs> my best uh, target as a horse. Yeah, I'm running out of food here. Who's, who are all these people? Uh, villages and caravans. Are they... Oh, they're attacking. Okay. So it's essentially a 2-on-1 uh, a -on battle. A 2-to-1 -on -one battle. M might be able to do something. Oh, I should have saved again. I think we'll be alright. We've fought worse odds. And... We got some decent heroes with us. Okay, so. So what are these guys? I don't know what they are. They are archers. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. And I have quite a few um, siege weapons, which is always very nice. Very nice. Are these pure infantry? Because then that might not be the best place for them. Maybe up top here. Yeah. What are these things? Uh, right. Bowman, there you go. These guys can come up top here. Yeah. And arrows. Over here. Okay. Horsemen. Horsemen, what are they doing here? Um, they can go get stop falling off. Oh no, shit, really? I didn't realize they take damage in this section. That's so lame. <laughs> what? That's bullshit. This guy's like, I don't need any armor. What's with this? This is a fork. Oh, I can push down the ladder with the fork. That's cool. Oh, the seed weapons are doing their job. That's for shizzle. My nizzle. These guys are just kind of wandering around though. It's kind of irritating. Get the fuck out of the way. Oof. That's a big one. I wanna I wanna go on a, a catapult. Back off. Oh, wow. <laughs> They're just getting smashed. It's fantastic. Oh, arrow barrel. That's cool. That's cool. I don't think these guys have too much of a chance. Hang on. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get the fuck out of the way. I want to use it. Emperor wants to use the mangonol. Get. It's off, man. This guy's just 
in my really getting in my face here yeah. is he aiming oh no oh actually i can't really aim i don't know what i'm doing never mind you guys use it oh, i did 40 death five damage that's nice Oh, wow, this battering ram is almost booked. Where's some stones? Can I pick up a stone? Oh, a thousand damage. Not bad. I wonder if I can kill the battering ram. Well, actually, I don't really want to kill the battering ram, do I? I want them to go through the main gate as opposed to the, uh, the walls. Boom! Uh, uh, who are these people? Okay, there's quite a few of them. This guy's <laughs> really putting his back into it. Come on, stop blocking me. One more. Gotcha. So they took over this area, huh? Alright. Let me pick up the fork. How do I... Oh, there we go. Oh, I can't be that heavy, can it? Oh, don't come... Don't come hit me. Good. No, they're putting it back up again. No. No. Piss off. Yeah, you can't even hit me. A loser. Do the fork, bro. Okay, I can't. Where's my fork? Oh, it's gone. Fork's gone. Could do it with a little backup over here, you know? Um, just a little bit. Who are these guys? Who are these guys? Come up here. Wait for him to come up. I know he blocked me with this shitty little sword. There we go, got some more, got some backup here. About damn time, am I right? All right. So it's all going quite well. We're still holding the main gate very strongly. It's gonna take them a while to get through there, I imagine. And then shield wall, then they need to get a shield wall. Honestly. Honestly. Should be a decent amount of upgrades as well after this, I would hope. Um, in troop composition wise. No more stones. Okay, so I would think that we're pretty much sorted over here. I don't need to do too much in this battle. The enemies were quite weak. But they should be because um, I haven't I defeated them relatively recently, like all of them. Like all like 2,000 of their troops. So if they came back with a full legions of legionaries, I would be pretty pissed off. Gotta say. Uh, but uh, luckily they didn't, and uh, so I'm not so pissed off. I got a, a skill point in tactics, that's fantastic. Alright, these last little stragglers, they are, they are reluctant to attempt to uh, <laughs> come in, because uh, their friends have tried and they didn't come back. For instance, here's one of them. Or oh, that one of mine. Could be one of mine. Why aren't these guys using the, um, the forks, you know, to push them back? 
push ladders down. They should be doing that all the time. Oh, come on. There you go. So we should be pushing forward a little bit now. A little uh, squish. Hang on, let's go. Let's go. I want to get in the front lines. Let's end this. Over the head and make them dead. Over the head and make them dead. That's what you just got to remind yourself. It's a little like kind of rhyme to sing in the middle of battle. When in doubt, take your weapon over your head. Over your head. Come on, over your head. There we go. And then they will be dead. Well, they should be dead. But uh, there we go. They're getting there. Maybe it's too big. I have had that issue in the past. So, let's get the smaller mace. And over the head and make him dead. Ooh, blood sworn roughneck. Who the hell's that? Taking a lot of like thousand little uh <laughs> cuts here. So it's a bit intense, very jittery. Don't really know what's going on. It's quite realistic, I imagine. Okay, we're pushing through. We're pushing through. And uh, while we push through, we'll like squish these guys along the side. They have nowhere to go, but um, to heaven or hell. Uh, no. Yeah, ranged with the scouts or the first one. Oh, there we go. So athletics, riding, tactics, um, leadership, trade. Trade could be good. I like the trade. I like the trade. Let's do that. Trade. For now. Might might uh, might use him, I might not. Good job everybody, good job. A, a fantastic defense. As always. I lost eight people. Who were they? Um eh, no one no one in particular. Alright. Got some more people to join me. There we go, there we go. Um, really another party? Come on, man. Like, how many armies can these people uh, put forth? It's a load of bullshit. That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. Let's get some more cohesion up in here. So if I could fight this army, then... I should be able to take Onira, which would be a kind of a good, I don't know, a good thing to do. And then I'll take Onira, maybe in the next episode. I don't know if I have enough time to take them in this episode. Maybe it's these guys. Um, you know, war, surrender or die, I don't care, so we fight, okay. I didn't want that other guy with 100 people to come in as well. So I wonder if my troops would be able to shoot from up top there, or shoot from down here and reach the top. Who's this guy all the way by himself? Is that the Empress? Oh yes, I recognize those beautiful eyes anyway. Hello Abigai. So my, the amount of slingers I have should be pretty minimal now, which is excellent because they're useless. Okay, so where are they going? Oh, they are they're up top here, huh? Maybe I can go to the top of the hill. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Could be good, I guess. Oh, well, let's give it a try. Oh no, here they come. Here come the cavalry. Shoot. Shoot them. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why are you just standing still, honestly? You know. Fall. Do your thing. 
No, there's the uh, cavalry archers, by the way. Oh, these guys do your thing as well, I guess. Doing all right. So I'm going to make sh sure that these guys are not charging. Come on, shoot the motherfucker. He's right in front of you. Shoot him. Shoot him. Oh, they are charging. There we go. Cool. Well, that is good, actually. That's very good. So you guys go a little bit more forward. Go a bit more forward. You guys can come a little forward and then go into a shield wall. And where's me? There I am. Come on then. Let's go. What's that? Sound like a big crash. Ah, gotcha. So wait, what are these guys doing exactly? I'm not quite sure. Fuck. Oh, they're not charging my actual troops. They're just kind of flopping along on the periphery. Oh, come on, now I'm losing my troops. I don't have enough. I don't have enough cavalry to um to just charge in the whole formation. Sorry, I knocked the, my headphone out of my ear. It's, it's kind of going on automatic there. Okay, yeah, this is annoying now. And very stupid from them. Very stupid. Put these guys over here. Then these guys are over here. What are these guys doing all the way at the back there, huh? Huh? Uh, there we go. Advance. Okay, that should be fine now. Should be able to kind of wrap around them. I don't know why the peasant is first. <laughs> it makes no sense. I'm just swinging my mace from actually hitting anybody. Don't let that stop me, right? I need that executioner's axe. Just like slice through like several people. I mean, it's what I need. How is the uh, the shield wall going? Very nicely. That's how it's going. These guys are here now. Why are they just charging forward? They just calm down. Just calm down. And uh, fire at wool. Obviously, fire at wool. Jesus, what have they not been firing this whole. God. Okay, stop the wall. Stop the progression and hold. Hold position. There we go. I still got a bit more fighting to be done. There we go. I always try flank, huh? Always trying to flank around the edges. Okay, they're advancing, advancing. There we go. Now we're gonna do a bit of flanking. You're not gonna like it. Okay, Bowman, maybe you guys can also kind of just, you know, charge a little bit. Because I don't know what they're doing down there. I've never actually seen a, a singer get a kill, but maybe I, oh, actually there we go, now that I've looked, I did see a singer get a kill. Ooh, crossbowman, huh? Not bad. Not bad. Seems like we pretty much won it, right? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, these guys are going very fast for being in a shield wall. Broken ribs, broken bones.
but the end is nigh. Oof, he got his one shot. I got my one shot. Mine was better. Um, going to shield wall alone. Just go a bit faster then. GG, well played, but uh, easy. You yeah, know, easy for the Romans, the real Romans, the Seleucian Romans. I'm a Phineas the Shark. Look at all these blues. Right. Okay, well that is pretty much it, so I'm going to probably skip to the end of this battle. And, uh, I'll see you on the other side. Ouch, okay, so. I only have 111 people left in my party, so I need to kind of work on that a little bit. But, I think that that is the end of this episode. And, uh, we didn't take Anira yet, but we are inching our way closer to being able to had to deal with a couple inconvenient parties which were threatening our consolidated uh, gains but we did get Metakia Castle so that was nice and now our kingdoms are relatively linked up it'll be better once we get uh, Onira but uh, until then which hopefully won't be very long We'll have to keep um, our, um, I don't know, just a, a little kind of out of defense with Metakia Castle. Maybe need to deal with um, Duke Oros before we can take an era. But that is all for the next episode. And um, if you want to see how that goes, make sure to tune in. And I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching and goodbye.